Hi everyone, it's Marina from Say Something Crafty. I'm here to do a share with you. This is going to be a unboxing for my design team um, items from Butterbee Scraps. Butterbee Scraps is now under a new business owner named Luann. Um, if you are subscribed to her, then you'll already know all about it, but I am super excited to show you guys what I got. And I'm also going to be doing a little project after I show you guys everything. I'm going to do a quick share and then I'm going to go ahead and uh, and make a project so or just like something small so you guys can see everything because I'm, I'm super excited so it's been a really long it's been a really long time since I ordered some stuff from buttery scraps and I'm like really looking forward to this so this is from my order and I got she's got a lot of doilies in her um, in her shop and I didn't know if you guys knew this but like when I when I'm crafting and I see people using these really really cute doilies and I have no idea where to get them I was super happy when she got the product in her store because that's I was like these are for a great price and I can go ahead and, and I can craft with I can do some shabby chic stuff without a bunch of thrift shopping and you know a bunch of washing and cleaning and you know, I don't know. I just I think this is great because these are perfect for journals and whatever you want to use them for really. So I got two different types of doilies. I'm gonna get some more later. I just was starting off. Um, this okay. These came out of here. Um, these are I got a bunch of keys. I saw she had a ton of keys and I didn't see them before. And actually, I actually haven't been to the shop for a while, so I was super excited. There's a ton of different keys and these are some of them there's just like okay hold on. these little tiny keys and then I have these um, knobs that I think would be perfect for a journal closure I like doing closures I got large book corners because I like to make large books so these are perfect and then oh, I got some more of these little keys over here hold on. and some silver bells I have bigger bells, but I want the little ones. The little ones are, are fun. Uh, let's see, I have these keys right here. I don't know if it's focusing or not. Then I have some of these right here. I got these keys. Oops, sorry. I'm so not good at this right now. <laughs> and then I got these metal closures here. Oh, let's see, they have screws and a latch. I like these latch closure, closures. They're just, you got to be more careful how you use them. This filigree that I've never used before, so this will be fun. I love the way this looks. It's so cool. And then these ones. These are some of my favorites right here. I like this. This is one of my favorites. And then I got these um, rhinestone dangles. These are bigger than the normal ones that I, the usual ones that, yeah, usually I get these little tiny ones. I love these little tiny ones. They're, they're awesome. I like to use them on charms and when I'm putting a little dangly on a journal. Um, let's see if they went through all these. Um, I have some more closures here. She's uh, ordered a bunch of new stuff in. I've got some bronze bells, mini bronze bells. It adds when I don't know if you guys know this, but when you're doing a when you put the little bells on a a charm, a chunky charm, it makes the little jingle of the charm like so much better. Then there's some already aged keys. Then I have these large ones and these. These are awesome, right? I love these. And I didn't even get. I don't think I even ordered half of the keys that they have that she has in her shop, so I'm gonna have to get some more. These are awesome. And then I have a large fairy charm. So I'm gonna figure out how to do that one. Oop, there we go. Alright, so I am going to have the link below for Butterbee Scrap Shop. And then I'm gonna be back with a small project for you guys. I don't know. I'm gonna do some um I know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna alter some of these for you guys. So if like if she doesn't have them, in, if you don't want to buy them, and or say you buy them in silver and you want to change them, or you buy them in bronze and you want to look different, I'm gonna show you how to do a little bit of that. So I'll be right back. 